Ah, such a wonderful day. Free from all the college stuff and no more work. Just chill and enjoy. Wait, let me just check if some new animes have released. Oh, what's this? Breaking news. This summer we have got ourselves some new wholesome animes with some spicy fan service. Yes, you have heard it right. Fan service, fan is, service back. is back. Fan service but whatever, I'll just watch a random one. Let me just browse one. Oh, what's this anime? Alia sometimes hides a feeding in Russian. Uh, let's give it a try. I've heard it's wholesome on the internet. Well, whatever. Let's go! 3.28 AM The anime looks pretty fun till now. Except some foot fetish. Everything's going quite well. Damn, bro. Damn! Oh shit, that was too loud. What are you watching? I, 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 I can, I can, I can, I can explain, mom. What are you watching? No, mom, I can explain. This is not I've what I've told this like. a million times for now. No, we are mom, not please, watching this no. thing in our house. You are grounded for a month. Give me that laptop no, right mom, now. No, please, please don't. Summer of 2024 brings some summer 2024 animes. Uh, that, well, uh, that that's a given. <laughs> oh, what, what am I doing? Summer 2024 brings forth some new and fresh stock of animes to watch and look forward to. And I look forward to a lot of those new animes. I've started three animes and those seem to be... Okay? Well, without wasting any time, let's start the free anime halfway honest but stupid review. I, I, I just came up with this name. I'm... I'm sorry. First, let's start with Gee by Sekatsu. I've watched about three episodes by now. I mean, only three episodes have been released so far and I like it so far. I, I guess by the time the video comes out, the fourth episode might have released. Well, this anime is made kinda like a suspense anime which unveils small details about the characters every each interval. And this really makes the anime interesting. Like, something different from the usual with a deep, slow and steady narrative. This is the kind of anime where you have to give them time to progress and such animes speak for themselves. The two protagonists are shown as two different poles and and completely opposite to each other but the small reveals about the character points yeah and the way the story delves deeper into the characters in every episode like really makes you feel a genuine bonding with the characters and the bond within themselves as well i really enjoy the melancholic or ambient choice of music that can be heard throughout the episode Emo, what up I'll just ask that this anime should not be kept as a hidden gem and need some genuine appreciation. Well, I'll give the anime some time to speak for itself, but for now, I'll give it a solid 8 out of 10. Well, moving on, next on our list is My Wife Has No Emotion. Okay, I had expected this anime to turn out a certain way and it did. Now, the story comes off as rather strange, where a lonely salary man buys a second-hand robot who does his house shows and cooks food for him. So lonely that he's ready to put a ring on the robot to call his wife. The story is pretty wholesome at some points and this anime, I would say, it's a light-hearted anime. It does have some romantic movements, but those are mild. Or so I thought. Bro, they're having fan service moments for a robot. I was shocked for a moment there. Like, bro, she has a what? Bro, she has a censoring this part. And the fourth episode is already called like my wife change into a swimsuit. Like, bro, I don't know, bro. I just leave it to you guys, like whatever. Another point of the robot is that the way Takuma, the salary man, behaves, creates deviations in the Mina-chan's program. Mina-chan is the robot, by the way, which makes her act the way she shouldn't as a robot, who just does shows and cooks food. And look at this frame, like I know it's too early to just look out for mistakes, but what are you trying to do, Imoto-san? Receiving a call? You're on a call, you're making a call, just please just tell me what you're doing. I can't make out shit from this. I would genuinely give this anime a 6 out of 10, but I would like to give it some time to progress as well. Like who knows, he might meet a girl who's actually real and I actually has real feelings for him. Well, we'll see. Next is Alia hides a feeling in Russian. I guess you've made out what this anime has to say from the skit in the beginning of this video. A lot of fan service. Like here, 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 this one, this one, this one, and this one as well. This anime turned out to be far more than I expected it to be and, and, it, and it turned out pretty good. Not gonna lie, I love the anime space and the classic rom-com plots for a classic rom-com anime. This summer is probably filled with some wholesome rom-coms, I guess. <laughs> If you've watched Nisekoi, you can understand how the anime is because it has the same childhood friends kinda story but it's the sister like oh my god bro well 
no wonder it was his sister called. Because look at their hairs at the scene. Aren't they similar? I assumed her being his cousin or sister. Like, no surprises there. Well, I genuinely like the story so far, and I would like to continue watching it too. I hope this doesn't put down my expectations from it. Well, those are the three animes that I've started watching, and I'll be starting some new animes too. And if you've started this anime, let me know what you feel about this anime. Do you like them? Do you not like them? Let me know down in the comments below and like this video if you like the content at any point of time. And I'll be bringing some more anime reviews soon. And I'll be making a completed anime, half way, uh, not halfway, but a full way honest but stupid review about these animes and the extra animes that I'll be watching. Well, subscribe for more and I'll see you in the next video. Madane!